This is Rebecca Moore at the Overlook School. Today we're talking about Three Times Lucky by Sheila Turnage. Trouble cruised into Tupelo Landing at exactly seven minutes past noon on Wednesday, the 3rd of June, flashing a gold badge and driving a Chevy Impala the color of dirt. And almost before the dust had settled, Mr. Jesse turned up dead and life in Tupelo Landing turned upside down. As far as I know, nobody expected it. 11-year-old Moses Laveau, Mo to her friends, has no idea who her parents are. She was found as a baby during a hurricane by a man she only knows as the Colonel, and he can't tell her much more since he lost his memory in the same storm. For an orphan of the storm, though, Mo has a pretty good life. She's grown up in Tupelo Landing with a Colonel who started a cafe and Miss Lana, who dresses in a different costume every day. Sometimes she's Marilyn Monroe. Sometimes she's from 1930s Paris or somewhere even more exotic. You never know with Miss Lana. So Mo is happy and busy. It always says exactly what she thinks. But she still can't stop thinking about her upstream mother. Often she writes notes to her mother and sends them off in bottles. So far, no response. When Mr. Jesse gets himself murdered, Mo decides that she and her best friend Dale will start a detective agency to solve the crime, even though police detective Joe Starr isn't as thrilled with the idea for some reason. Nevertheless, Mo and Dale begin investigating. But Mo finds she's not prepared for where the investigation will lead her and what it will cost her or what it will teach her about her family. Three Times Lucky by Sheila Turnage.